Tim, are you still with this company? I had ops, bro. And it's just so crazy to me. As soon as the lights turn off, bro, they'll be behind your back. If you know me personally, we're down bad. Who was there for them, bro? It was me. Hey guys, it's me again. Welcome back to a brand new video. Yo, we just uploaded a video a few days ago and we're already uploading this video. I've been on a roll. I just like, I really came back to YouTube because I got tired of seeing people uploading the same boring content, at least here in Houston, with the exception of like two YouTubers out here in Houston. This shit's been dry as hell. Like I got tired of seeing people upload full day of eatings or motherfuckers out here really trying to reinvent back and bicep workouts. Like bro, it's 2020, 23. Are you still onto that old shit? Yo, I've been on a roll, but before this video gets started guys do me a favor leave this video a like because everyone's been showing mad love to me which i appreciate it but i guess like y'all people are forgetting that there's a like button so go ahead and like this video up before we get started no like it's cool i'll wait go ahead and do it bro but yeah guys welcome back to a brand new video yo i'm super excited to start uploading like what is this like my fourth or fifth video back i miss you guys i'm never gonna leave again yeah i mean i might have been inconsistent the past three or four years but look for the people that are saying i fell off look i didn't fall off i just stopped caring about social media i just stopped uploading i just stopped being present but like look i did it once now i'm gonna do it again i believe in myself and yo like why not if you're watching this video you can accomplish anything bro you literally just have to do it but yeah in case you're wondering i'm here in the back seat of my car which i'll show you in just a second well i'll just tell you right now but let's go ahead check out the whip But yeah, man, I was really in my backseat because I want to show you guys. Look, I got tint on my, yo, can you guys even see through? Like, bro, I got limo tint all the way around. Yo, shout out to Duran's window tint for taking care of me. Yo, this shit looking spicy, right? Yo, fuck it, we're in a cute little montage, right? I think you realize how excited I am for like this tent because yo it is in the middle of summer here in Houston it's like literally 105 degrees right now I'm out of breath this is not only like making my car less hot it's at, yo people can't be peeping in my car no more bro yo I think they just found that those people that went missing on that submarine for the Titanic or whatever yo am I the only one that thinks that going 13,000 feet in the water sounds like a good idea it's like super tragic and it's like that shit's like fucking crazy but like got so many questions bro but like that's shit is actually crazy bro also it would mean the world to me if you guys do leave this video a like maybe drop a comment down below but more importantly let's get this video to 200 likes but also let's get me to 50k subs bro support my hustle right now i really want to get to 50k subs before the end of the year and i can't do any of this without the help of you so it would literally mean the world to me gang seriously yo she finally starting to show guys yo is she bloated or is she pregnant i finally got the dub boys trapping her is she pregnant or is she just bloated Stay tuned for getting in July. All jokes aside, guys, we're here at the gym right now. I'm so fucking tired. Being here at the gym is literally like the last place I want to be right now. But yo, we have to do it. We gotta stay on the grind. Do me a favor. Quit being fucking lazy. Go work out. Go exercise. It's never gonna be fucking easy. Go touch some fucking grass while you're at it. I've been killing my workouts, bro. Big trust that I'm really about to be him again in like two months. My whole body is sore, but yo, we brought our favorite toy into the gym today. Whoa, one of our favorite toys today. And it's like literally making our workout. We for real brought this shit inside the gym today. I won't show you, but you guys can hear the shit. Hold up. Yo, you guys hear that? On some extra, we brought our toy to the gym, bro. <laughs> yo, yo, I like to give a huge shout out to Bob and Brad for sending your boy this massage gun. I know I'm like six months late to this promo, but yo, like Drake said, better late than never, but never late is better. <laughs> I got him, huh? I clickbaited him or not? Nah? Maybe my stomach's gonna clickbait though. <laughs> <laughs> yo, I echo. Yo, like if you got that one shorty in the gym and you don't know what to say to her type shit, like, yo, can I massage your back? And just like pull up behind her and just put that shit on her, bro. All right, look guys, I just got home and like, I just want to settle this. My girlfriend is so team TikTok, but she like stays on TikTok. And it's like, it's so funny because if I'm not watching Twitch streams, I'm watching YouTube videos, but she's like on TikTok. So like, I'm just going to try to see uh, what's going on on TikTok and try to give him one last chance, you know? <clears throat> All right, here goes nothing. Like I'm she said she wanna 
Bro, what the f this is what I'm talking about, bro. What the fuck? Bro, what kind of world do we live in nowadays, bro? Lately, I've been doing these sauna workouts just because, like, they're only 15 minutes. And it's like, yo, you guys see how hot it is? 129 degrees, bro. I've really been enjoying these high intensity, like, interval training cardio sessions here in the sauna just because, yo, what is helping me get right for the summer? Summer's already here. I got a vacation planned in, like, a month and then another one in two months. So this is gonna help me get right, boy. Trust, trust this is the new wave. 15 minutes. Today I'm only doing one 15 minute interval just because I'm gonna hit back and biceps later on. Most days I'll do like a 30 minute workout in here. Bro, I'll be sweating for days, bro. Look at this. Yo, if you got one near you, you gotta try it. Just because I haven't been showing that many workouts does not mean your boy has not been working, bro. Look at this, you guys tell? I think it's hard to tell, but. I'm sweating, I'm sweating. I think it's time to finally address this, like just to stop the questions because I get DMs, I get comments, I get tagged in comments, YouTube comments, Instagram people on my message request asking me. And at first I was like, yo, I was kind of like pressed, bro. I'm like, why are people asking me this? It's been like six or seven months already. But I thought to myself, I can't even be mad just because I haven't even been present on social media with the exception of these past few videos. So like, I get it, bro. So let me just address it now. And this will be the last time I ever address it on this channel just because life goes on people keep asking yo tim are you still with this company i'm no longer with this company anymore bro and it's been seven months basically in a nutshell i had ops bro i had ops people were praying on my downfall people were like waiting to try to catch me lacking bro and it's just so crazy to me that like People who you think are closest to you will be the first to turn on you, bro. And that's just like anything in life. What I've learned is that like, you think you like people have your best interests at mind. As soon as the lights turn off, bro, they'll be behind your back ready to fucking stab you. If you know me personally, like if you know me personally, I move with good intentions. I have a good heart. Do I make mistakes? Yeah, everybody makes mistakes, bro. What's even crazier to me is like, motherfuckers were down bad, contemplating life, bro. And who was that person giving them opportunity? People were going through crazy shit in their life. People were going through so much. Like, who was there for them, bro? It was me. Motherfuckers were facing life-threatening things in their life. Who was there? It was me. It's been seven months. I got no bad blood. It's all love because it's seven months ago. Life goes on. That's like more than half a year ago at this point. But it's just like to address the comments and the concerns that I keep getting from everybody. And you guys have the right to ask who have been with me since day one. I'm just no longer. I, we've parted ways. Life goes on and I'm super thankful to have learned from that. More thankful that I was finally free of my chains after all these years. Because looking back, I'm like, bro, I was super complacent. I was stuck in life. I, I was too busy helping live out somebody else's dream right for the first time in my life i'm actually taking part time right now with the company just so i can spend so much time with tatum this summer like this is the first time in forever that i get to spend so much time with her because life is too short, bro. But more importantly, I'm super excited to move on to the next chapter of my life. For me, myself, and I, for Tim Rodriguez, for my future, with the help of my close circle. It's all love, man. Like, it's all love. I got no bad blood, bro. Like, life's too short to, to hold grudges, and I can't keep living in the past. Like, I can't be stuck on thinking about all this shit. I had ops. I had ops, bro. I sound crazy, but like I had ops and uh, yeah, that's just it. It's unfortunate, yo, but uh, I'm a big believer of like what goes around comes around because guess what? At the end of the day, it's all love, baby. It's all love. We all good over here and I'm super excited for the future. And that's all that matters.